Hi guys, welcome to Baiju's exam prep. Now, while preparing for any competitive examination, especially a highly competitive examination like GATE or Engineering Services, there's one doubt constantly in the mind of the students. What if I don't get the result I desired? What if I don't qualify? So guys, you know, and, and especially when the last two, three months are left for the examination, the doubt becoming more and more prominent in the mind. It's very natural, okay? The more closer you come towards the exam, it's pretty natural to feel panic, to feel more pressured, okay? To be very honest, preparing for competitive examination involves an element of risk, okay? Don't worry, it's not only you at the risk, it's lacks of aspirant at the risk. I started my preparation in the fifth semester when I was a third year student, right? I was blank when I started my preparation, especially about the competitive exam, especially with respect to the gate level. Only thing I knew about myself is that yes, I can I can put off my bet, I can I can put up my hard work, I can really work hard, and then wherever the results go, that, that destiny will be seen. Okay. I also, you know, was dealing with a certain amount of risky. Okay, I'm giving, you know, day and night. Okay, I don't know what, what will happen even if I don't qualify, but my hard work paid off and I got a single digit rank 9 within the first attempt. Okay, so as I'm mentioning, of course, guys, don't worry, it's not only you are at the risk, every aspirant preparing is at the risk. You know, uh, you know just I'll, I'll give you one brief example. Okay, J just imagine a situation. Okay, there's an aeroplane. Okay, comfortably landed on the ground, okay, just idle at the moment. and. Imagine another aeroplane, okay. passengers are loaded, ready to take off and finally it takes off. Which of the aeroplanes, according to you, has the more value? Undoubtedly, the aeroplane which took off, loaded the passengers and took off because that's what it actually meant to do, right? That has value. An aeroplane standing, standing idle, comfortably on the ground has no make, no meaning, has doesn't make any value, okay? But at the same time, which of the two? Aeroplanes is at higher risk. Okay. This poor fellow sitting, na, just just standing idle on the ground. What risk does it carry? Nothing. Okay. But at the same time, the plane which took off, the moment it takes off, okay, there's an element of risk by chance. Okay, some mishappening happen. It crashes by chance. Okay, although that element may be a small percentage, but it has an element of risk. But at the same time, it is more valued. That's what you have to understand here. If you want yourself to be valued in life, you have to take an amount of risk. Now, it doesn't mean that competitive exam always comes with a risk. Definitely, you know, there is a maybe I say 5 to 10 percent element of risk, but majorly it depends on your hard work, on your determination. Okay, but yes, to be valued, you have to take a certain amount of risk. Okay, in case you are one of the students, you know, feeling a lot of pressure, planning to give up. Okay, yeah, maybe your surroundings, your friends, sometimes they are not supportive and they are giving you a call ki, bhai sab tere se kuch nahi hone wala hai. If you are developing that mentality and maybe you are planning to quit, maybe now, maybe tomorrow, maybe day after tomorrow, yeah, maybe after a week. I'll just tell you one thing. I'll give you one guarantee. If you don't prepare, if you just give up, if you leave it up, I give you a guarantee nothing is going to happen. I mean, you don't get any results that the guarantee. You don't get anything okay, out of this particular examination, especially if you don't prepare hard in the last two months. Last two months are the game changer for many of the aspirants. But at the same time, okay, if you keep preparing, okay, maybe sometimes you're getting less marks in the test. Maybe some of the concepts are constantly troubling you. But if you keep fighting, if you keep learning from your mistakes, if you keep overcoming your mistakes, if you, you know, just discard the nonsense that your friends or colleagues might be speaking about you, okay, unka to kaam hai because some people get themselves successful by pulling others down. Okay, so maybe their intention is wrong. Be very careful on what sort of company you have. So if you, you know, discard all these things around you, if you keep trusting yourself, if you keep overcoming your mistakes, there is a certain probability. Of course, I can't guarantee, but there is a good probability that you will come up with the best results. Maybe, you know, whatever your target has been, however your preparation has been, you definitely go to the ranks under 100, under 10. But again, I repeat, if you give up, I guarantee you're not going to achieve anything. Right? That's what. So, you know, success in life is never, never comes out of some magic. Koi jadu nahi hone wala ek dem se. It takes your sweat. It takes your determination. It takes your constant hard work. Okay, to convert your dream into reality. To see, to such the success in life. Also, at the worst case, I'm telling you, know, there is an amount of risk. Okay, be prepared that you don't get the expected result. What you targeted in gate examination. Does it mean the life is over? 
okay right gate is just one small element of life okay yeah some of you might be in a situation ki yaar you are already sensing that till the gate i'm not able to complete the syllabus i'm not even able to complete 60% of the uh, 70% of the syllabus what should i do should i quit no guys keep doing even if the till gate exam maybe you are able to cover 60 70% syllabus okay you know what will happen at least you will see some flavors of the gate examination maybe you can have a very good attempt maybe the next year okay also be ready guys just one week after the gate examination engineering services prelims will be there okay once you enter the march bark examination may be there so maybe till gate you are able to cover let's say 70% syllabus okay so at least 70% done na when you're going to go for exam like bark or escrow you can cover that 20 30% because ultimately the technical syllabus more or less is same 90% examinations it is more or less the same right but if you stop right now if you stop at 20 30% okay and then suddenly bark or isro or nil it any notification comes up you have to restart okay and suppose the isro examination is announced and suppose it is announced in a duration of 2 months what will you do within 2 months you will not be able to do 100% so i again suggest maybe if your syllabus if you are feeling you are not able to cover till gate do as much as possible okay because uske baad bhi exam aayega there are so many technical exams after that okay at the same time okay now again you might be having that fear I will complete the syllabus also, but I am doubtful. I am fearful that what will happen in the exam. Maybe that single day goes bad. That element of risk is there in the mind. But again, I am telling you guys, NILIT exam will be there for you. H, you know, several other exams like you know, HPCL is going to happen this year. B Bell examination is there. Okay, BML examination is there. Guys, there are n number of opportunities, and they come up at the run time. They come up at the end moment. Okay, you don't know what 2024 calendar is going to be. Okay. you can have maybe 10 or 15 separate examinations okay coming up in short notice one month two month or three month okay what you have to ensure that you become technically fit and how can you become technically fit by completing your gate syllabus with honesty i again repeat as i mentioned in the beginning the only thing that worked for me was my honesty and my hard work i'm telling you know third year student okay nobody thought neither my teachers thought nor i thought that within the third year i'll get the single digit rank my honesty my dedication towards my studied okay made me achieve that when i started studying i started developing interest i started developing interest okay i kept on studying more and more more and more more and more i came into a zone where almost throughout the day okay of course uh, you know uh, definitely uh, taking the essential uh, sleep essential food and everything and some refreshment also okay but other than that rest part of the day no other time was i was preparing because i got so much involved okay i trusted myself so guys Also, this gate preparation, guys. Whatever the result may be, but I'll tell you, it will teach you one very important thing. See, now uh, it's been 13 years I gave the gate examination, but still till date. See, imagine 13 years back I gave a gate examination. You know, but what that taught me, rather than the All India Rank Nine, rather than I going to IIC, what is the bigger picture? Uh, it has taught me. It has taught me to work work hard in life. It has taught me to face challenges. Right now, if you are a true aspirant. fighting hard for competitive exam you will become a true champion who know to face challenges whenever the challenges come later on in your life in any organization you are working maybe private or public sector okay you will not be you know you will not be uh, puzzled at that stage you will not panic at that particular stage because it's a very important uh, element of my life i'm working hard for my career right if here i feel pressure if here i give up okay almost my entire career can be spoiled but i don't give up i face challenges i also feel trouble sometimes working this or that but i never gave up because i have developed that attitude okay since my gate preparation time that's what guys this competitive examination ye temperament sikha dega aapko ye aapko uh, you know jeevan mein mehnat karna aur jeevan se ladna sikha dega that's what you have to understand guys so get exam less than 3 months left uh you know i hope you have had a safe or prosperous dipavali i've enjoyed a lot okay but at the same time mujhe laga ki there might be several students feeling demotivated planning to quit up i thought to make a small video always remember that if you would give up if you don't prepare i guarantee you are sitting here i guarantee you you don't get achieve anything but if you keep trying if you keep trying 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 you trust yourself okay let your sweat come up keep your determination to the fullest to the highest okay 100% something or the other in life you will achieve maybe it is in the form of gate or engineering services or bark or gale or sail or isro or drdo or nilit or hpcl or bell i don't know there will be n number of uncountable things be prepared for it okay keep trusting yourself all the very best keep rocking always do not give up okay you should always keep trying that's it thank you stay safe and take care of yourself